All right, so our tech trends now. Uh, used to be you met a member of the opposite sex and just trusted your gut, right? Well, then you could Google the person if you felt like you needed to. And now there's a new option. Take a look at this. Rather than trying to guess what might be wrong with this guy, why not get some facts? Why not date check him? <gasps> How far is that coffee place? I'll block the door. Holy sh this is amazing. His criminal record, clean. All his social networking information, property he co-owns in Hawaii with a guy named Jack. Huh? Date check. It's a new application that you can download to your mobile device. It includes a sleaze detector that checks a person's criminal record for things like convictions, sex offenses, felonies, even misdemeanors, a net worth check that shows details of any property the person owns and how much that property is worth, and even a compatibility check. That shows the person's birth date, horoscope, and astrological information. The company behind this new technology is called Intellius. Its chief marketing officer, Susan Kohler, is joining us now live from Seattle. Susan, good morning to you. Good morning, Heidi. I think one of the things we need to talk about is where does an app like this come from? Is this from people who are more and more meeting on the internet and they really don't know, they don't have any references as to who they're maybe sitting down to have coffee with? That's exactly right. You know, the world's become so transient. People move, they're in big cities. It's not like the old days when you were dating somebody next door that you've known their family for a hundred years. And with the social networks and the online dating you talked about, it's really exploding out there. People need to know. Yeah, and you mentioned in uh, one of the uh, pieces of information I read about this is that, you know, you can read MBA, but does that really uh, mean a, a master of business administration or does it mean married but available? Absolutely. All the stories that we get with people using the product and writing in, it really is, there's a lot of deception out there. There's people with a lot of false personas and people want to know. They don't want to waste time and they don't want to get hurt, whether it's heartbreak or the risk of physical injury. Yeah, because some of these things can be very serious. We're making light of it right now, but uh, yeah. seriously, uh, when you're talking about uh, prior convictions and so forth, it can be very serious. Uh, what about legal issues involved here? Is it difficult to put that type of information out? Well, what we do is we um, correlate from billions of records that are out there, and most of these are public records from the courthouses, from legal documents. So that kind of information is accurate tied to the name. We present that. We have an ability to basically synthesize and analyze 80 billion records so that we can get that individual information to you on the go. Okay, so what if I have a name, though? I've decided to go meet this person for coffee for the first time or maybe okay. for a drink or whatever. But sadly, his name is, you know, John Smith. Yeah. Uh, how do I know that what I have pulled up on my phone, which is highly alarming to me, uh, is the right John Smith? Right, so the John Smith that you just put in, and you would have had to have his By name. the way, I would never date a John Smith. <laughs> no offense to, to John Smiths out there. Anyway. Okay, well, first of all, you'd only need one piece of information, the name or his email or his phone number and we can go to work for you now we'll say with that john smith what his address is you get that right away so right then you might have an idea of which person it is or which it isn't then we take you to the sleaze detector that's where we can correlate and say how many criminal records are there for the john smiths in this state all of that is free okay. if you want to get more details then you can click and pay a fee it's 1995 to do a state criminal check, for example. Okay, understood. So you really got to make sure you have the right person, clearly. <laughs> that would really be embarrassing if you didn't. Uh, what about this award? Because you guys are getting some press now, obviously. is one of the reasons you're here. You guys won a pretty big award uh, in San Diego. Tell me about that for Day Check. Yeah, it's the Demo God Awards. Basically, they premiere the top 70 applications for the mobile phones. And we were there demonstrating, and we got, you know, some great response. There's been a lot of press. It's a product that the time has come. If you look at some of the data of what's going to happen in the next couple of years, by 2012, that's only a few years away, there's mm -hmm. three trends that are happening. One is people are using social networks through the mobile phone more and right. more. It's going to go from 80 million to 800 million. Yeah. Then the whole dating online market is going to explode. It's going to be 
$1.4 billion in terms of a market. Yeah. So there's a lot of trends that are going on here. Definitely. And then mobile smartphones, they're going to double. They're going to represent 23% of the mobile market. All right. Well, you guys, uh, seems like you're definitely onto something. I know you have some other products. Uh, Nanny Check, the same idea, uh, looking into uh, nannies that you may be considering hiring. Uh, certainly something uh, for everybody out there. We really appreciate the time.